Okay, it'll go live now. Hold on. Ugh. Okay, Tam, don't don't click on the X in the right top corner. Yeah. <laughs> just, just click on got it. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Wait, what? Oh, got it. Okay. Oh, got yeah. it. I clicked on the X before and I shut Zoom off and everything. <laughs> oh, you know, I noticed that the other day. That must be a new thing. Yeah, it's fairly new. Oh, my yeah. gosh. I'm so sorry, guys. Technical difficulties. Let me share the chat with you. Oh, I'm pasting the it right now. difficulties is Wendy got carried away. She got a new set of tassels. Yeah, that's what it was. <laughs> she was making them go the opposite way. Wow, talk about some technical difficulties. Oh, oh my gosh. I forgot my tassels then. Dang, I don't know what to do with tassels. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Wow. Sorry we're late. We had some tech. Well, I had technical difficulties. I hope you guys can hear me fine and see me fine. Hello, Karen. Hi, Noxal. Hi, Amber. Freedom. Oh, Amber. Karen. Faith. Carlos. Linda. Jonathan. Jocelyn. Shafi. Pam. Al. Bob. How you doing? Hope everybody's good. I'm so sorry for the delay. This is like the I think the latest I've ever been. Like ever. Hi, Advocate for Liberty. Hi, John Jim. Tops. Lady Liberty. Hello. Hello. Sorry, Liberty. Sorry. Hi, Bonnie. I just got chat up, so I'm looking. Nams. Dream usually doesn't pop up until 10 after, but I didn't see it this time. Thankfully, you got a notification. Oh, wow. At least the notifications worked. <laughs> Hi, yes, yeah, yeah, and rainbows. I am so sorry. I'm so stressed right now from trying to get this shit up from, I literally already wicked everything. I was early, and I've been fighting this for, like, going on 45 minutes. Free rider, how you doing? So as you can see, Pam is gracing us with her presence today. Pam is well, good. Thank you, Tim. I appreciate you letting me wait. What am I trying to say? I'm getting it backwards. You letting me enjoy your graces. How about that? Oh, no. <laughs> Something like that. Me. I'm always here. <laughs> Paper Queen Becky, how you doing? Lights. Oh my gosh, I can't believe we're finally on line. Like, like I, you have no idea the shit I've been going through. Hi, girl. Grr. Oh. I did it for her. Maybe um, it as you know, Damila is not going to be here today. She oh. mentioned it last week. She's actually visiting her oh. sister. So her sister might not be in chat either today um, because of oh. that. I can't even find my own email. Vapor Queen Becky. I love her name, Vapor Queen Becky. I said the other day, I'm going to change my name to Queen. I love it so much. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Vaping Snowman. Hi, Kevin. Oh, welcome. Man. Welcome. I got to lower the light or something. Like... Hi, Kevin. Hi, Kathy. Kathy. Hi, everybody. Oh, my God. I'm no, sorry. I'm still loading that. stuff oh. because, like, literally, I've been fighting to get my internet up. I can at least come on. Hi, a pea. An advocate for liberty. Is it a pea chai? I'm hoping so. From Thailand. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> That's exactly what happened, Tim. <laughs> What's that? He was trying so hard. I told him I'll bounce later. Hi, slushy. Slushy. <laughs> <laughs> Mila is stuck in the Oculus. Don't let her fool you. Exactly. <laughs> it, exactly. Hi, Barry. Hi, Barry. Hi, MCX fell. MC. Welcome, welcome. My computer is running so freaking Very slow. I miss everybody. Oh, my gosh. You know, look at everybody. I just... When he has my malware awesome didn't cat. even... She and does. I don't know if like, her wow, virus is or anything. So that's done. I'm Keeper. It's Sashi. Hey. Hey, yeah, it's just exciting to see people. It's like <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. Let's see. Share. Oh my gosh, everything's running so slow. Oh, I know. I hate that when my computers run slow. Oh my gosh. Thailand in the house. I'm trying to do shit and it's not letting me. Come on, save a cup. Let me see. I had to break out an old school. <laughs> White Delrin drip tip, Wendy. Remember the oh, old wow. Delrin? <laughs> oh, 
you're going I had everything over. ready. I felt so good. I was going to be on time. I was actually going to be early. You had all your links. You you did um I had everything. Uh, Twitter, done. you did Instagram. Yeah. And I had time to spare. And I whipped up four Addies. <laughs> That's when you know, you know. Jeez, so yeah, things go here. seem to go a little bit better when you're rushed and you don't have extra time. Huh? I know, <laughs> then everything just pops right up. But no, not today. Why? Jeez. Because Wendy's on your mind. Oh, my head right here. Ah, I've been having that all day. It hurts. It hurts oh. so good. How's that Bentley kid doing? Oh my God, did you see my post? No. He stood up today. Come on, awesome. What was yeah, that on I, Facebook? Yeah, I put it on Facebook. I put it in the group and then on my page. I rarely go there. Facebook's the devil, you know. Coconut. Yeah. Uh, I was going to show you a picture of me, but no, oh, that's I not see the it. right one. <laughs> there he is. Oh my gosh, oh, you get that so hair. That's he's, so he's got oh. Amish hair. His hair is only growing from the front. None has grown from the back. Oh my gosh. It's all Amish. What's yeah, wrong so is, he what? stood up for the first time today and he was like this and Esther took pictures. So what's hanging off his shoulder? Looks like one suspender or something. No, that's his bubble. His pacifier. Oh god. <laughs> I've been vacant for cool. mixing shows of late, except a few. Ah, oh, Celeste, well, thank you so much for being here. Brandy, welcome. Yeah. Mark, welcome. Coco, how are you doing, sweetheart? Nems, hello. Uh, thank you so much, Nems. Nems. Abdul, Hi. welcome. Hi. I want to make sure I got everybody. I think I got everybody. If I didn't get you, just go ahead and say hi again. Arnie, I literally got on like six minutes ago. I had some technical difficulties, so you're not late. I'm actually late. Welcome, Arnie. Um, we yeah, had to so clean Wendy's computer out. She's got some, she had some interesting porn links on there. I got to <laughs> tell you. <laughs> it's all that damn porn. Why don't they have safe porn? I don't understand. Yeah, no. Hi, Moogly. Hi, Moogly. Yeah, so I got, that was today. Um, we're actually going to be doing a live liquid review, too. Because. Oh, yeah. hey. Brad sent me one and I was like, forget it. I'm just going to do it live. So I'm going to be trying out this tiramisu custard. It's Ooh. from the finest e-liquids. Oh, damn. So I'm going to try that today. Tiramisu custard. It's, you uh, know what? It's going to have a hard time going up against our pumpkin cheesecake. I know. We got to try that. I've got that here ready to go because, again, I did not tape it because I said I'm going to save it. Ah, uh, that's Evan. awesome, Nem. Is sorry. that the one you posted? There was another one we, we were supposed to try, I mean, too. Addy, oh God, my... No, that was the one from Trucker Show yesterday. The um, um, coffee ice cream. No, but the pumpkin cheesecake, is that the recipe you posted? Oh, that was Fresh's. No, this is uh, Wendy's. Oh, okay, I got you. All yeah, right. this okay. is because I came up with, um, this is so well, this is the oh, cheesecake that I made for Addy that time that we did the... Um, the what do you call it when you ask for money um yeah like a benefit call? like a benefit the thing. benefit yeah oh, the okay. benefit yeah. for um i think it was for rye and i made addy a cheesecake during that, that live stream that we were all on so i used that as a base and then added pumpkin and took out the strawberry so <laughs> That's the one we're gonna make. I've also made the greatest ever milkshake base, vanilla milkshake base. So we had made last week. We made um, or the week before last, we made a pumpkin milkshake using that base. That came out awesome. An egg, an eggnog milkshake using that base came out awesome. The base just works for everything. It's just yeah, it's amazing. really good. I'm really really excited about the cheesecake because I was in a cheesecake mood, and of course. I hate steeping, but we had to steep it. So I let it steep yeah, for the whole I week. It. I didn't try it. I didn't taste it. I didn't I didn't do any type of cheating. So we're going to try that. Karen, how you doing, sweetheart? Karen. And who else came in? Blue Blaze, how are you doing? Ordered raspberry, hey. e-juice, no nicotine, and a gold smoke V2. Awesome. 
Linda Marie came in. Hi, Linda. Yeah, Linda, how you doing? Yeah, Linda was up a little bit. She oh, okay. It was her phone that I was late. No, it was me. Yeah, I know. We're going to give Camilla the one day off. I mean, one day, you know. I mean, she... I know. It, it, it doesn't feel right without her doing the growl thing. I know. I tried it, but I was still uploading, so I hope you can see my hand. Oh, honey, the I cheesecake smells you. really, really good. It smells just like cheesecake, like real authentic cheesecake. You can I, smell the graham I, crust and everything. I made a 25, so I've been... I made a 30. <laughs> <laughs> okay, man. I'm down to uh, like 12. Somebody else came in. Who else? It was somebody... Just oh, Chevy's in. here. Hi, Chevy. There he is, Chevy. How you doing? Oh, but I am so looking forward to this. So I, I guess we'll see. try the cheesecake first. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I wanted to show you guys something. It's not for review, only because I can't find it online anywhere, but I thought it's the coolest thing. I don't know if you guys remember, but like a couple years ago, I mentioned that I wanted to make like a big bag, like a purse, and I wanted something like it. Smoke came out with one. Smoke, smock, whatever you want to call it. Oh my God. So they sent me this as a gift. You never know who it was from. <laughs> and I was, I know, I know. It took me a while. I was looking for a card and everything. I, I just didn't know who it was. Hi, Queen Honey Bunny. So I opened it already. And then I went back and I was going to include it in my, in my um, review that I have pending. It's editing. And I was like, I can't, I can't because it, there's no, why would I bring it up if you can't purchase it anywhere? It's absolutely awesome. Right here is like um, got that like shiny plastic feel to it. Yeah. But it's got like it's a leather here. I mean, it's a perfect female bag, like perfect. Yeah. Actually, this could also be a guy's bag. I, I don't see why it, will, it couldn't. It's got like these elastic strings here. It's got a zipper on the back. Like, who doesn't need them? Nice. It's got a little shoulder strap hooks too. Jo yep. John and it's got a nice you, thick shoulder wouldn't. strap too. Look at Even if it was it's that, it matches it perfectly. Sweet. Well, look at these hooks. Oh, I like that a lot. Those are nice. This is so like I I wanted to use it. I'm like, no, I'm gonna review. I'm gonna put it in the review. And then I, when I was looking online, I was like, I can't put it on the review because nobody can buy it. That's like so unfair. I I would take like a sharpie to that so quick and just black out I know, that. Right? <laughs> I've thought about doing that, but I don't want to get it on myself either. Look at the strap, and you can make it long. You can make it short. Oh, I like that. I've been looking for a new strap, but I just need a solid black Look at strap. This, this oh, is like so freaking awesome. That's pretty and cool. And look at the inside. I don't know if you can see the inside, and it's got a huge pocket right there too, like a side pocket. Oh, that's nice. Is this it is like just awesome? Like inside, I really can like you it. like wipe it out and stuff and? And so it feels like sort of it. it feels like it would deter water too. It's got like that feel to it. It's not, I don't know. It's really, really nice. I've I've just wanted to show you guys so that I can start using it because this is perfect for me. And the strap, you can make it longer, you can make it shorter. I just yeah, I wear all my purses like that. So that yeah, they're easy but they gave it to it. me as a gift, and I was so at look at this. I'm making it shorter <laughs> now. That thing goes I'm so good. excited for it. I'm going to wear it the, uh, during the show. But um, <laughs> I'm just going to have it here. I'll be putting all my e-liquids there. But oh my God, it's so freaking nice. It's just, it's like, look, you can, yeah. It's just, it's the perfect, perfect size. To just run out, put your put a couple mods in it, put some juice in it, put your phone in it, put your like cards or whatever in the back zipper or your little wallet thing. And just go. I'm I'm happy with it. But anyway, I wanted to show you guys so that I could finally use it. <laughs> Isn't that cute? Hi, Becca. Yeah, now I, mean, I, I want one. I don't mind that, honestly, because I just think that it's too cute. But Come on. yeah, I just, and it's like, I think they're like, um, what do you call it? Laminated on there. So I could probably get them off, but I just, I don't know. I just, I love it. And it matches perfectly. The black and white everywhere. They just. They did a really, really good job. I'm loving this bag. And this strap, because it's not too thin, so it's not going to cut in. To yeah, no, that, that, I can tell that's a nice strap. And I love the, I mean, look how big it is. I'm not going to lose a box yeah, the, of shit. Those <laughs> clips. That's nice, those clips. I like it. So I had to show you guys because I was, like, so excited with that. Okay, okay. Now we can try the cheesecake. 
Let's do the pumpkin cheesecake, cheesecake and then I'll do this as a live review. I'm going to wait a little while so people can come in. Vapor Queen Becky. Let's see who else was here. Kathy Gibbs. Hello, hello. Becca Nichols. How you doing, sweetie? Well, it would be a fanny pack if it didn't have the long strap on it. <laughs> But it's really, really cool. I really like it. It doesn't just have that zipper on the front like a fanny pack does. It's got the other one. Oh, my God. It's really, really nice. I wish I wanted to come out with one myself. That's exactly what I wanted to come out with. But, you know, trying to find people to make shit like that or make it yourself, it was just, it was, it was too much. So but that's what I wanted to make for me. Now I need, uh, there we go. I've I, got I, a fresh I, mic right here. Gonna nice. try that cheesecake. I have oh, a big pool. I have a big spool of leather up there. You want me to send you a big old piece of leather? You can make a, a nice. No, bed. I don't want to make it myself. <laughs> <laughs> I have a ton of leather where I was making earrings and stuff, but oh, cool. I don't. I don't think I can do like bags and stuff like that. That's like exactly. That would take Jeanette, too much time. Hey. Hi, Cindy Jeep girl. How you doing? Hi, Cindy. Hey. I absolutely love it. It came out, it's so nice. And I wanted to show it off, but I'm like, it doesn't really belong in a review. And like, people aren't going to, you know, you can't buy it. So I was looking, I was looking for, <laughs> I know you'd, you'd piss off all your followers. Exactly. Exactly. Um, but let me see. Did I not save that one? I saved it. Why? Oh, you know why? Because I called it something Patty. I called it Patty's. You know what I could do is I could make you a big vinyl sticker to go on the front. Oh, that would be whatever. perfect. Because I have a, um, what is it called? I have. I know. Um, I can't think of I the can, name of it. It does I all the graphics. Print, yeah, I can print. Um, graphics. Graphics. Now, I have a printer. Well, the ink that will do the yeah, sublimation what's it print. Firefly or something what i forget what that machine's called that you have yeah but i can sublimation print where it's like permanent ink on even like an iron-on or whatever and but i do have the applique thing yeah i do have a you hot have a press. press i have a yeah, heat press i have that too look at me <laughs> you know <laughs> i'm working with you we're figuring it out yeah, yeah i do that a lot like that hand gestures you know <laughs> yes <Right>. of course <laughs> um oh, and I have see... a cricket too. yeah i have a cricket <laughs> yeah that's a cricket yeah i do have a cricket but i also have a sublimation printer uh, yeah, thank I'm, you, I'm totally... flushy wants <laughs> to know what to use in place of the one-on-one -on -one marshmallow vanilla for the milkshake base that, that i made like what would be a good substitute for that one um a little bit about the same percentage of the uh or a little bit less of flavora marshmallow okay there you go slushy try the flavora marshmallow whatever the percentage is just drop it down a little bit maybe a quarter of a percent oh karen seabalt says put wonder woman on it wendy <laughs> no put wonder wendy <laughs> <laughs> there you go you can put a picture of your devil girls on there i know oh my gosh but anyways you know what I never saved the recipe for the pumpkin cheesecake. What? I can't you find it. Did you it? save yours? Can you share it with me? I I just, I let you post them and I, um, let me see if. I'll no, but remember I, I sent it to you guys so that you could get the, yeah. the measurements or the weights. I don't know. It's not here. And I thought I saved it because Thank I would have had to, to share it and it's not here. Yeah, I would have had to share it. I got pumpkin milkshake, pumpkin. I got the eggnog milkshake, but no cheesecake. Did I name it something? No, there's nothing else. Wonder why. Hey, where am I? You I had to have saved it, though. I wouldn't have been able to share it. Yeah, that's kind of odd. It's not there. I don't have it either. Well, I definitely don't. <laughs> well, you well know do you think that maybe, do? like, I don't you know. Did anybody save the recipe stream. from last week? Hi, Kevin Spicy. Did anybody save the pumpkin cheesecake recipe last week that I put up? Apple butter. 
I know that it's based off of yours and we just took out the, the strawberry and I put the pumpkin. I think I put it at five if I'm not mistaken. Right? I can't believe I didn't save it. Yeah, it, like even as private or nothing. But that's what I'm saying. You you usually put it as private because yeah. you're saving, you know, you're adjusting it and stuff. And I do the same thing. <laughs> and I would have shared it privately. So I know it would have been there. Something is really weird. It's crazy. Uh, let me see if I can find that cheesecake I made you. Oh, wait. Pumpkin custard cheesecake bratty. No, that's not it. Why would I say December 21st, 2019? Did I make you a pumpkin custard? I, that's crazy. I I really think this is the one we made last week. Hold on. That's <laughs> your sure I mean, it sounds just like it. If it's, we use the Innaware biscuit. Yeah, everything's. Do no. we? Use yes, water? this is it. This is it. What do we do? 5% of VSO pumpkin? Yes, this is the one. But oh, you know what? I I think I edited my original instead of um, adapting. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's what happened. So, yeah. So, how do I make it like current? <laughs> Adapt it? <laughs> Adapt you it, keep it? You don't because it goes to the original date of the original recipe. Oh my yeah. gosh, this is so stupid. Is All right, I'm just going to save it new. Um, you know, just like um, adapt and then I'll just save it new and that way everybody can have it and I can post it. There we go for today. And now let me make it unsaved. I saved everything. That's probably why I have like five trillion recipes. <laughs> no, but, but by accident lately, this is the I second time I did it. Now. What I'm doing is in, when I, instead of me adapting it, I'm changing the original. Oh, I apathy. Yeah. Wait, it says that it's a copy of the recipe. Oh, because yeah. Okay, hold on. Now I got to change it. And then I'm just going to call it pumpkin cheese. So apathy asked me a question on um, my ELR. I just want one of these in here. I'll get back to them. Yeah, that Lakota um, plum cake came out nice. I made some changes to your uh, initial recipe, and I think it would be really good with um, VSO fig instead of VSO plum, too. Oh, I, <laughs> I haven't tried anything with figs. <laughs> okay, so here we are. This is pumpkin or figs. cheesecake. You haven't tried what? <laughs> well, we um, sub fig for raisin one time, and I think you liked it. I love sweet fig from Flavora. Yeah. Not the regular fig, the sweet fig, I think is really good. Have you tried the VSO uh, but fig? I don't know that I've tried the VSO. I yeah, know it's I really, it. really nice. I need to try it. But I used it for a raisin. That's what I use it for a lot of times yeah. was the raisin. But I know they have a raisin now. I don't think I have. Yeah, fig is a raisin. It's pretty good. Mm hmm Yeah, we did. Uh, we've made something with a couple things with uh, VSO raisin, right, Wendy? A raisin? Yeah, did we do like a raisin rice pudding or? We did yeah, we did a raisin rice pudding or a raisin um raisin something. Hold on, I'll I'll let you know. I put, why did it do it again? It, it privated. It, it I changed went. the name and it still privated it. I don't know. If you can click on the link I put in chat. Try it now. Hi, David. Hi, Apathy. Marked as private. Oh, see? I don't know. It says that it's the same name. It's because it's a copy of the recipe. It shouldn't matter, though. Is it your daughter? It's been forever since she called you during a live stream. And usually say hi. You want to say hi? We're on live on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even have my phone in here with me. I just left it in another room. Hopefully nobody needs me. <laughs> I don't think they will. Um, let me see. Hi, Captain Spicy. Spicy. I'm going to have to change something on here, and I don't want to change anything on here. So the other one had strawberry, but I don't remember the strawberry. So it's not going to let me save it because I have to change one of – oh, I know. I put super I sweet. I'll just put, like, 1% more. Hold on. Or 0.1. That's all I need to do. Make it different. 0.52. 0.52. 0.52. 0.52. 0.52. 0.52. 0.52. 0.52. 0.52. 0.52. 0.52. 0.52. 0.52. 0.52. 0.52. 0.52. 0.
I like super sweet. I'll take it for the win. Yeah, Donette, that's a great way to do. Just do one shots. It's nice and simple. Yeah, that that's the best way to yeah. start. It's the best way to start. Oh, is just do your you one shot. You you must have known I was coming on, Donette. That's why you're on Jack tonight. That's why she's doing that. <laughs> Is that one of yours, Tam? Yeah, that's one of mine. Yeah. Oh, cool. You know what my favorite one is? I know. It's one of mine, too. Cookie I chow, just... baby. Oh, yeah. Cookie chow all day. I love that stuff. Yeah, DIY flavor changes. You can get it there. Yeah. Okay. I saved it this time as open. Here you go. Hey. Try it again. I put it in chat now. I was going to so say, I'll go, I'll, I'll go adapt it. <laughs> yeah. But I think that's that's definitely the one because I edited it instead of adapted. So that's done. All right. So we're going to try that. And then we're going to do the live e-liquid, commercial e-liquid tasting, which is the one that I got from Brad. Brad sent me this, the finest e-liquid. And this is a uh, tiramisu custard. So we'll try this after. But I have to try this pumpkin cheesecake because oh, well, this looks it good. <laughs> it's, it, it's pretty damn good, Wendy. <laughs> Did you see the recipe, Pam? Yeah, I'm looking at it now. It looks really good. Yes. That's, I made it before, but with strawberry. It had two different oh, strawberries yeah, okay. in it. So I took all the strawberries out and I just put the pumpkin. And this VSO pumpkin, it, it's got its own spices and stuff once you hit right, right. 5%. Yeah. No, but after 5%, that's when you can really. Yeah, you start tasting the allspice in it. All yeah. That, yeah allspice mm -hmm. stuff. Yeah. Awesome, apathy. Let me know your thoughts. I'm trying it right now. I mean, I know that it's got to steep for seven days, but yeah, I'm the just, initial wait, was still are we, good. Are we mixing something later? What are we doing? Yeah, we'll do some. Well, I'm not sure yet. We're gonna come up with something. So later. I'm just wondering. Well, I don't know how long it'll take me to find all. <laughs> <laughs> hey, sometimes sometimes we just shoot the bowl and we. Yeah, so we, we just make anything. something no brainer. Yeah, it's not going to hurt if I start pulling flavors to mix it later. That's the thing. I could just start pulling flavors to mix it. Okay, so this is coming out really, really good. It's nice and sweet. It, the pumpkin's definitely coming through. The cheesecake is a nice, thick cheesecake, which is what I like. I don't like it too thin. You're getting the graham cracker crust on the exhale. You're getting the pumpkin and the sweetness. If you use the super sweet, you'll get more of the sweetness on the inhale with the pumpkin mm -hmm. really really good and that cheesecake is really nice vanilla like it's like a custard cheesecake so it's nice and full yeah it's nice and saturated it's, it has a really nice mouth feel super thick yeah i love it in my mouth it's really i know <laughs> <laughs> oh we were doing good what were we i don't remember which show i was on saturday but i don't know I don't know what we were talking about. Whether so it was, was Frank like or OGA or. <laughs> One of them, but I said something and I had to cut it down short, but I like it short, but I like it with a thick, a thick tip on it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was oh, it. it was my tank. I know what it was. It was my tank. I broke the, I broke the tall tube for my, um, Voltro. That was and yesterday. I had to put the short, I said I had to put the short dick on it. <laughs> That was yesterday. Okay. Yesterday on Mike's show. Okay. <laughs> I still can use it, and but I I still like to have the like on this one the big round tip on it. <laughs> as long as it's got that, the short dick's okay. <laughs> so you like to tailpipe right. it? You're tailpiping it right now. Yeah, <laughs> right <laughs> now. Yeah, I got I got to refill it and stuff. So. <laughs> <laughs> now, now we're all gonna watch when you take a vape from it. I know. <laughs> Hi, Barry. Hi, David. Just making sure I'm saying hi to everybody. I just don't know about all that Spanish rice stuff. So, you know. Did you get to try the phantom ravioli from Giancarlo when it was out? No? No, I never did. And I really don't think I need to. It was it was really interesting. The garlic was, bread for me was probably the most. Yeah, bad. we did. We did Tommy, uh, Tommy V's uh, stuffing. Yeah, right, but at I first remember it was you guys garlic. did that, yeah. yeah. If you have all the stuff to do it, you should, it's pretty interesting recipe to try to experience. I mean, and it tasted got, good. It, yeah, it's still on my list. I've got to send it to Tim, an advocate for liberty. I, um, pickle Rick, I've done that. Um, the pickle, but and that was like interesting, and it was authentic. Let me tell you, 
um, and I'm sending it to um, an advocate for liberty, and then he's going to vape it live on one of the shows. Oh, cool. Yeah. Awesome. I, don't, I know Gizzard Stu did that uh, pickle yogurt. It was uh, called pickle liquor. <laughs> <laughs> hi roy welcome sweetie oh the link for james i do i will um i have it right here i'll drop oh, you it. Have it good see you are yeah. so pretty he is yeah, always so right there. thanks for reminding me <laughs> this pumpkin tea comes, comes with really really good. i'll be so yeah isn't it good good it. job wendy came out nice that turned out really really good i always want to retry that base that i have for the cheesecake that i made you yeah, the strawberry one because I knew that you like strawberry, but this is really good, especially for the fall season. Came out really, really good. Yeah, it's tasty. I'm glad I made a big bottle. Yeah, me too. Uh, let me see. We had oh, you know what we were supposed to make? We have What's on the, the list. Uh, I had to pull out the notebook. What's on the list is pumpkin spice latte. Ooh, so and that we have, we're gonna probably try tonight. We have the okay, other I'm, one to I'm try. Good with that. We have the other one to try too. The Caramel apple pear. Yeah, we do. I'll shake that up. Here, here you go, Addy. <laughs> That's better. <laughs> and bounce it up and down. Yeah. Get them tassels going. Get to the left, go to the right. <laughs> Smells good. Did you try it already or no? Yep. Yeah. And? I haven't tried it in a couple of days, but I've been trying it like during, oh. during the week. And it's definitely changed. It's gotten better. Okay. Let me just dry this out a little bit. Oh, I got to log in. That's the problem. Okay. Let me go. Add a new tab. There we go. My vapes are usually so thick and big that it's easy to dry it out. There we go. Wow, that you're definitely getting the baked apple right on the inhale. Now, what yeah. apples did you use? Is this VSO too? No. no, this one was, hold on, let me get that one. That one I know saved. <laughs> <laughs> that one saved, the other one didn't because I edited it instead of creating her. It's called the Fall Caramel uh, Apple and Pear. And the it was um country apple, mm -hmm. and we used shape up pear by Mullenberry, and we used VSO pear and caramel biscuit from SSA. Oh, nice. Okay. And then we used something else too. Uh, this butterscotch is butterscotch cream, cream pie. pie. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it came out nice. It's it's pretty spicy. Apple. Yes, I know. It tastes like if you, if you have like you know, a real baked apple with all the spices. Yep, and some like places of pear in it. Yeah, it's really, really good. I'm surprised on it, honestly. Okay, it so I put so, it in chat. It wasn't too good off the shake, but it came, it surely came around. <laughs> yeah, it did, because I'm off the shake, I was like, mm. Hi, James, welcome from California. Hi, James. Welcome, welcome. From Canada. Oh, it's Canada? Oh, retracted. I thought it said restricted. Never mind. Like, what did you do? Oh, I gotta send. Uh, yeah, that came yeah. Up good. I gotta send Tam your ice cream base. Yes, send them. Yeah, it's just called the milky. Hold on. Yes, we do. An advocate for liberty. Yes, it's do. milky BK milkshake. I'll oh, put it in I chat. I need to see it. Yes. Cherokee. Hey, Cherokee. Buddy. Hi, Cherokee. Actually, awesome, awesome, Becca. Oh, cool, Cherokee. Becca. Is, it Is that the one where the coil drops straight in? Yeah, where you actually create the, the sub ohm coil. That's cool. Uh, that's interesting. I've seen that. And here is my milkshake base. If you guys are interested, here it is. I'm putting the link in chat. Hi, Mallory. So, Hi, Hi, Peter. Okay. I <laughs> James said he's pretty far from Cali. <laughs> well, it says CA. So for me, since I work in insurance, yeah. CA well, is I California. I saw the so. flag. I wasn't real sure. Was it Canada? I, don't but I, I thought Canada. 
In Canada, isn't that C N? Nope, C A. But California is C A. Yep. Yeah, all the Canadian websites end with dot C A. Oh. oh okay. Marshmallow vanilla. Yeah. I can go um, down the, the end of the driveway, out into the street, and look it? right and see Canada. Wait, I, yeah, on. but you'll just be roaming anyway. So. I know it. <laughs> super, super sweet. Hi, Mallory. Hi, Peter. Yeah. Oh, Hi, Robert. Sorry. I, I get excited when something chips. <laughs> <laughs> My uh, order from Vapor's Club shipped. I ordered that. Um, hold on, I'll tell you in a second. I ordered the side by side Abyss, Abyss side by side. Oh, okay. From Suicide Mods, yes. And Dr. hi, one. How are you? Let's see, everybody else. I get everybody else. I think I did. Yay. All right. So, should we do the live e-liquid oh, tasting this- now, or should we wait? I think we should do it now. Yeah. Okay. Because I'm kind of excited for something from Brad. I know. Well, I did the lemonade. The lemonades I got that I did that review that actually came from Brad's. Because oh, I was those, asking, I'm like, those three, did you get the, the lemonades? Le- the three lemonades, the strawberry, yeah, the, the lemonade monsters from the Monster Line. Yeah. And you like the one you didn't think you were gonna like? I best. know. I really thought I was gonna like the watermelon the best, but I like the strawberry the best. Oh, and the pink girl. Wait. Oh, you. Oh, you're in Canada too. At first, I thought that was a G, and I'm like, oh, you're in Georgia? Canada, okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, in insurance, every time I'm putting in a state, CA is California, so that's why I just, you know, and I work insurance, so. All right, let's go ahead and try this. Tiramisu Custard. It's from Finest Signature Edition. This is actually the same <laughs> as I tried a regular, I think it was a vanilla custard. Right here. I got it. Oh, you got that one? No, we're talking about my scale. One show oh. we did, I did with the Advocate for Liberty. I could not find my scale anywhere, anywhere. And then after the show, guess what? I found it on the drawer here, uh. on the on this drawer where the keyboard goes, oh. like right under my nose, literally. <laughs> <laughs> I looked everywhere; I it was right here, <laughs> under my nose. Yeah, I do. It definitely smells like when it's firing, you can smell the tiramisu and it literally tastes, it smells like the tiramisu cookie. I like love the smell of tiramisu. Oh my gosh. But it's got the, the vapes. I just can't. It tastes just like it. Exactly, exactly like it. Oh, it's really good. <laughs> yeah, Cindy, you and Spicy come visit. Oh, really? So, um, I'm excited to get it. I really am. I'm excited. Hi, Kristen. Oh, so I just put a link in chat. Our our buddy Friction, he he's on a lot of uh, mixing shows, and he hosts uh, Noted. He hosts a lot of shows, like Mixing Vixens and Noted. Mm-hmm. He's um He got... A big part of the community. Yeah, he got terminated from his job because of, you know, the government. And... Uh, Oh, because of the, you know, they were scaling back because he was uh, doing security. He was doing internet security oh. or VA. Yeah. And he scaled back his. Um, oh. He's a veteran and stuff too. And um, That's yeah, he just had a new baby. Like. Yeah, just had a baby, and unemployment is not. Yeah, they ran out on that. Well, no, he he hasn't gotten any benefits for like eight months. Yeah, hi, so Crystal. The, hi, Christian. And it was lucky he had savings, but they went through. I mean, you know, it goes, you know. Yeah. And so now, you know, they're getting in a bind because they're you only have so much savings and you don't have any money and four kids and a new baby. Yeah. yeah. And so they need some help if we can. Yeah, we love friction. That sucks. Yeah, that's he is a big terrible. part of the community and su- super, super nice guy. Super. So this definitely tastes like the tiramisu, but you know what? It also has like that taste of coffee. Like when you dip it, right? That's what it tastes like the tiramisu. But in like you took, you dunked it and then you ate it. That's what it tastes like. Yeah, every tiramisu. I'm not getting the coffee, custard. Like 
not too strong, just a little. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, nice. Okay. That's good. Just like if you dunked it, not like you drink yeah. it, but like you dunked it, that kind. So it actually tones down. You know how the cookie is kind of not overly sweet, but the coffee kind of brings out the sweetness in the yeah, coffee. Yeah, yeah. That's what I say. I'm not getting the custard, but I am getting that. And it's really, really good. It tastes authentic, like really authentic. You getting a lot of whipped cream? Not too much, but it's there. It's like just a light, like, you know, on it, but it's really, really good. Thanks, James. Yeah, thank you. That's really, really good. I like it. If you like tiramisu at all, I would definitely highly recommend this. If you're in my group, you can actually just go ahead and message Brad Payne and he can help you out with that. Just send him a message. Um, but it's this is really authentic. The, the, I've had a tiramisu e-liquid before and it wasn't as authentic as this. And yeah, it literally tastes like the tiramisu it's dipped in I mean, coffee. It's, it's really, really good. It's it's so is, um, is this site still open? No, not officially, no. Not officially. But if you message him, he can get you stuff. Um, Becca, that's great. Yeah, that, um, let me see. You have the, all right, but are you using one or two of the coils, Becca? Because one will be 0.37. If you're using both, then it'll be 0.18. So I think you're probably, if I'm not mistaken, you're using a single coil, so that's correct. Yeah, it'll say 0.18 on the little tin. Yeah, if it's in the, for the, oh, uh, but you're building it for the. Yeah. Okay. So it's probably a single coil. Yeah, in a Cleto thing, it should be. A yeah, for sure. Um, for a single coil, yeah. For dual coil, it'd be 0.18. Depending on yeah, the length yeah, of your legs. Long. If your legs are really, really short, then it comes out a little bit higher, but yeah. Be I, used to have, I used to have bigger legs, but as I'm getting older, my legs are shrinking. So my leads are getting a little short. <laughs> are those all your legs or just the, the oh, two all main of them. ones? All of them. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even going there. Oh my God. I heard it's not supposed to be the leg. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> I heard that. Did your ohms go down because of that? <laughs> yeah, show your crush. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hi, Jeff Prince and Terry Vapor. Hi, Jeff. Sheboygan. Hi, Terry. That? Terry. Terry from Sheboygan. Yeah. That was a good change. That was good. Oh, congrats, Licky Licky. That's awesome, Licky. Yes, yes. Keep up the good work. It's it's getting a little harder to do depending on what country you're in. Exactly. But hey, if you can do it, do it. Heck yeah. And also, if you guys don't know, I did go ahead and purchase more custard monster because this blueberry custard is fire. <laughs> Just saying. I'm a stickler for blueberry custard, and this is amazing. Now, do you like that better than the glass? No, the glass is a cake. It's a different one. Like, this right. is a custard, but the glass, no, I love that. Okay, oh, I didn't but know. But the if thing it's... is, is that I, I kind of, like, overdid it for myself because I was vaping it so much. I literally yeah. vaped, like, over 500 mils within a a month so i'm giving it a little bit of a rest but yeah this one and while i can get it i got it <laughs> lemonade in here okay <laughs> from the uk all right licky licky i'm from the states but hey oh, we still love in, you guys. you're in good shape in uk well for yeah. right now yeah you guys are good you're like one of the best places to be. Yeah. Or, yeah, definitely. Well, a lot better than us. You know, for us, it's like killing us. <laughs> God, I know. I got to put the links out for the call to hey, action. Chucker. Chucker. Hi, and yes, oh, I'm man, still using, baby. what is this one? I the nitrous. The nitrous RDA still have it on this. I, it's not moving. What I got to really... That's pretty. These two together just are perfect. Is that a squonk? Yeah, that's the top side light. Oh, I have a top side light. Why don't I have that set up? This one, you can actually make it just a regular mod. Yeah, yeah, I have it. Yeah, I have one. I forget what I have. 
shoes. <laughs> Oh my yeah. gosh. Well, it's going to be nice to have some extra setups pretty soon, I think. Yeah. But I don't know. This I, Ever since I did the Nitrous RDA um But review, yeah, if mine looked I like that, it was red and black and sexy like that, I, I would use it too all the time. Yeah. Because that one looks sexy. I like it. It's just amazing. Mm -hmm. It doesn't do it for me anymore. I've been doing it since I was 14. Now I'm 18. I live in the UK and 18 is legal. No, but here on this channel, unfortunately, it's not legal if you're under. Eight. No. So sorry. You shouldn't have been vaping at 14, but that's no. just mine. That's why we're in this. Sorry, guy. In. I had to hide him from the channel because yeah. I'm not taking any chances. Yeah, YouTube doesn't like. Uh... Um, no, licky, licky, whatever. Um, I've been vaping since 2014. I've been vaping um, about six years now and reviewing for four and a half, I want to say, four and a half to five years. But I, I, we were pretty much all smokers and switched to vaping. We didn't yeah. just vape just to vape. No, right, right, no. Yeah, it's a single coil, Becca. Then that's what it's going to be. The the resistance that's on the on the actual container is for dual coils. Whenever you have one, you actually just double that amount, and that's what you should be getting. So you know, that's perfect. And there's something to be said about vaping for vaping too, because a lot of people um, function a lot better with nicotine in their life, and there's nothing yeah. wrong with that. Right. Well, I do. Sometimes I will. I usually do 1.5 milligram. And sometimes I will go up to two, two and a half, mm -hmm. depending on stress and stuff. Right. Because I know that it will kind of help a little bit. Yeah. And yes, I'll Terry, you can watch. <laughs> so Dr. <Terry>. Uh, <laughs> Dr. Charles Gardner was just on Regulator Watch. I'll put the link out for there. But man, that okay. was a really good episode. Oh God, I gotta pull that out now. Thank I'm you. surprised how many people don't watch the regulator, regulator watch. It's, it? it's like a vaping news channel. It's like, yeah. and I don't understand why more vapors aren't watching it. Yeah. Yeah, I get notifications, and I I never do. I need to watch it more. Where did that other? No, but even if you look at their subscribers, it's so low. Their views so low. And I mean, with all the vapors that are out there, you would think that more people would be watching it. Yeah, he's been, and he has some really good special guests, like a lot, a lot of doctors from the, you know, tobacco harm reduction yeah. community. Yeah, this, this is it. Yeah, yeah, mine's solid black. It's taken apart right now, but I gotta. Wow, yeah. spicy started. Uh, oh, you found it? Yeah. Yeah, I have it all right here. Yeah. Now you make me want to get it out. Awesome, Al. Mallory, that's awesome. Ten years. Yeah, I smoked out. for many, many. I started smoking when I was thirteen, so I was oh. smoking for a very long time. I didn't. I was a late smoker, and which is really stupid on my part. But thanks for popping in, Christina. Hi, Christina. Uh, no problem. You have a great, safe week too. Yeah, I yeah. don't know. With this nitrous RDA, it's yeah, just fun. amazing. I'm absolutely loving it with the nitrous. Do you like it better than your um, your nudge? Well, the nudge I only have for like e-liquid tasting, but for this is just clearly just squonking all day, all night. And I have my strawberry um, strawberry <laughs> shortcake. <laughs> Another purchase. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Yeah, I got I got quite a few of those empty too. <laughs> yeah, I started really, really young. Oh, Kristen bought a Blackstone grill. Cool. Awesome. My goddaughter's father has one of those. They're great. <laughs> That's funny, Tim. We uh on weather. I didn't be the wife tonight at golf three. <laughs> Definitely, I'm out. I know the yeah. wife's gonna win. She's due for even a if win. The wife's not gonna win. The wife will win. <laughs> She's due for a win. Yeah, yeah, 
You're we've betting been, on the weather? Oh, yeah. We've been uh, um, Nikki, a lot It's really up to the individual. If you feel like you're ready to get into RDAs, that's fine. But normal stock coils are just as good. Plus, now you can even get the smart coils, which are like stock coils that you build yourself. I have some reviews on those. I always say don't <laughs> force yourself because everybody else is doing RDAs or rebuild refillables. Right. You go at your own pace. If that works for you, then let that be it. Um, I'm don't don't feel forced you. because vaping is is individual. It's whatever helps each individual. And if it's going to help you stay off of cigarettes by you know using a sub own tank, then stay with it as long as you want. If you get curious, you can look into reviews. Every single one of my reviews for rebuildables is like a tutorial. You can literally walk through it. But if you're going to start building on RDAs or rebuildables, you definitely want to look into um, Ohm's Law as well as battery safety. That's number one yes. first and foremost before you ever even think about it. And then from there, once you've learned that, then you can go ahead and learn the building skills. And because the building is, it's all based off of not just your coil, um, your coils, but it's also based off of your coil um, height or, you know, the, how high it is, how low it is, how it's hitting the airflow or the airflow is hitting your coil. It's all about wicking. If you've got too much cotton in there, sometimes it'll actually diminish the flavor as well. So there's a lot that goes into it. But right now, if that's what's working for you, I definitely, definitely recommend just sticking with what you're comfortable with right now. I just put yes. a couple of links in there. Nicotine overdose oh, if you are vaping, I did stop uh, coils for the uh, first I'm, like three years. Yeah. If you're vaping a high milligram of like salt nick in like something that's not meant for mouth to lung, you can get nicotine overdose. You can get actually sick. So I don't recommend, I personally don't recommend nick, um, um, salt nick anyways. That's just my personal recommendation. I won't, I would rather you use a higher regular nicotine. Um, but if you are using any type of salt nick, make sure that you're using it with a 0.8 or higher coil. Um, resistance because you can get sick from it. Oh, shoot. Don't do that. You know, and if you're in the U.S. and if you want to think about getting a rebuilding, I mean, buy a couple RTAs or RDAs now because coils mark might start get uh, hard to find. Yeah, they might. But then again, it's going to be overseas and it won't really be an actual device. It'll be coils. So I think that'll be the last to go if it goes. Plus, there's always black. <laughs> just saying. <laughs> it's just sickening. Just know a friend. <laughs> yeah, yeah. How about who you know? <laughs> you know, I, I feel so bad, though, for, you know, because there's so many older people that don't know, have the connections. They don't know how to really navigate the Internet. To, exactly. And, though, and it's just so easy to go back to the corner store. And get exactly. a exactly. It's a shame. It's it's a shame. The whole thing. Well, the thing is, is just them learn listening or seeing or somebody telling them that it's bad. They automatically go back to smoking. They don't even really yep. look into it. It's like, oh, it's bad. Okay, forget it. Let me go back to smoking. So, yep. mm -hmm. and that's it's you know making sure that you're telling people that it is a safer option. You're you know telling people about it. I've actually got a review coming for this little guy right here. And it's like a disposable, but it's actually, you know, where you, it, you refill the pot. So watch for that. Really, really inexpensive. This would be great for a starter. Like if you oh, know man. somebody and you want to get them some, this would be a great, great starter. The review will be up this week. Um, it's actually being edited now. So that's also good. You know, something simple to where all you got to do is you need e-liquid, you need your device, you fill it up, you vape it. You throw out the pod, you put in another one. You don't have to worry about replacing coils because you got to remember that a lot of people, you know, in the reviews will be like, oh, well, you can't replace the coil. I don't want it. That's fine. But for somebody coming off the smoking, especially older individuals, they want easy. Yeah. It is easier yeah, to go and just buy this already done where all they have to do is fill it up with e-liquid and have to insert a coil that they can't see. Yeah. or they don't know about, or they don't know about YouTube videos. So I always recommend something like this. And that's why I'll always, I won't do disposables on my channel, but I'll always do easy um, type of devices like this for people wanting to quit or even Christmas coming. 
and you know somebody who's wanting to quit and getting them something like this, it's really, really inexpensive. You can buy the refill um, three pack of pods for like not even $10. So with this and three packs of, of the pods is under $20. Like that to me is a perfect gift for somebody. You're yeah. saving their life. You know, you're giving them something. And then all they need is e-liquid and that's it. And it'll last them. And this is a true mouth to lung too. It's a loose, like on the looser side, but not too loose, but it's like the perfect draw. So watch for this. But I really think that, you know, that is really, really key is let, is the ease of the device. Like all of us know about, you know, we've been vaping for so long and it seems repetitive that all these pods are coming out. That's all I ever hear. But we've got so many different people out there that we're trying to reach to get off of cigarettes. Yep. Not everybody likes the same shit. Exactly. So we about that if somebody yesterday. doesn't like, say, for instance, the caliber and they like something like this, it's there for them to choose. If they finally see it and they're like, wow, that looks something like something I would like. It's, it's all a matter of preference. Like not everybody likes the same RDA. Not everybody likes the same RTA. Not everybody likes the same sub own tanks. Not everybody likes the same devices or pods, you For know, pod sure. tanks. It's, it's all a matter of, you know, choice. And you've yeah. got to have the choices out there to reach those individuals that it might just be that one thing that looks like, you know what, that looks easy enough for me. I can do that. You know, rather than changing out a coil, just take this out, put another one in, fill it up, you're done. That to me is what is great for a new vapor. Yeah. Me personally. I agree. And that's why I keep, you know, I keep reviewing them because it's just, so, so many out there that, you know, some people just think that are a little bit harder than others, you know, and especially the older individuals, they don't want to have to put a coil in it. Shit, they barely want to even use their lighter to light a cigarette, you know? God, my mom um, really struggled when, you know, just with, with the little Evats, yeah. you know, because you had to take the base apart, you had to, yeah. you know, get the coil in right. It's like, you had to clean it out, and then you got to fill it, and got yeah. rid of it's leaking, then you got to get it back down, you got to get the case, and no, this is like, this has no buttons on it or anything. It's literally just auto draw. So you put it in your pocket, you put it in your purse. This is very true. Okay, but that's it's it. Very, very true. That can't get easier. Very true. Hi, Daryl. You know, I, I mean, one good thing, because uh, a few days ago, the FDA finally approved a uh, uh, a vapor device to be on market that end up being a crappy views by a big tobacco company. But uh, Mitch Zeller, the director of the FDA came out and said, you know, this is appropriate for the public health. And if, and it does help smokers, you know, smokers can transition to this and, uh, and they'll inhale a lot less chemicals. So they're actually coming out and say, yeah, vaping is safer. So yeah, exactly. hello? yeah I'm like, hello. I mean, yeah, Mitch Zeller made a statement and I, I posted it on uh, Twitter yesterday about what he said. So they really can't deny it. Yeah, you know, because they're approving some, but they're all working the same way. So why approve some and not others? I know. Um, but at least you can... I don't really, personally, I don't recommend jewel devices. I think that the amount of nicotine in them is way too high. It's more to get you high than it is to get you off cigarettes, in my personal opinion. I think that it's just a way too high of a nicotine. A lot of people use them. A lot of people like them to quit and that's great. They, they're they actually big sellers, but personally, I would rather have something that is refillable rather than it already comes with the stuff already in it and it's at a higher milligram. And people yeah. don't understand the percentages either because what they'll do is they'll put like 5% on the package and people think that it's five milligrams. Yeah, it's, it's 50. not. That's 50 milligrams. Mm -hmm. I, I think it, he's in the UK, so they have 20 milligram pods over there. Yeah, 20 milligram is fine, but anything over that, I wouldn't recommend. Yeah, I don't it's, think it's, it's not. It's, it's more to get you high, high or dizzy and than it is. But that's just again my nice. personal. Right, you know. and Jewel has gotten million people millions of off of cigarettes. Yep. And it is, it's, it's good for a lot of people, but the thing is, is then they, they kind of withdraw from it. Yeah. Whereas you have to with beat vaping, off. regular e-liquid, you're not getting that same type of withdrawal because you're not vaping that high of a nicotine. Becca wants to know what little device, you, what pod you were using. 
Um, this is called The Solace by Smoke. Again, the review is coming out this week. Um, it should be out probably tomorrow, if not Wednesday at the latest, but it's, I'm currently editing it. It's not a really big um, video, so it shouldn't take me long to edit it as well. Yeah, there you go. Mm -hmm. Hi, Ashpaw Cowboy. Oh. But yeah, so I mean, the Cali burn is great. But again, you have to put in the coils. You have to put in the coils. Some people just don't want to do that, or it's too difficult. And if you make it too difficult, they're just going to go back to smoking because it's so much easier. You know, Asphalt Cowboy, how you doing? Welcome, welcome. So we want to try to think about this pumpkin spice latte or what? Yeah. Let's yeah. I know. I'll put in the first ingredient. I say pumpkin from BSO. <laughs> yes. That was easy. I think we should go up 5%. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we know that flavor pretty damn good now. So we got that. Well, okay. I yeah. kind of think we food. should do cappuccino from, no, or espresso from BSO too. Yeah. Espresso from BSO is good. Yes. Yes. All right. So. Okay. From BSO, BSO. Okay. Do we want and a lot of espresso, like a lot of coffee, or just a little coffee? That's a good question. It's good. Um, well, it's got to be a latte. So a latte is not a lot. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's got more of a milk froth to it. Yeah. And oh, a latte. So, so you want the coffee in there, but you don't want it to overpower the latte. So, so probably like, like, a, like if you were going to, to um, Starbucks and you got a pumpkin spice latte, it's not going to have so much coffee in right it's more cream and pumpkin than coffee yes mm -hmm. it's like a shot of espresso isn't it got it so like one and a quarter one and a half yeah and then it'll grow too correct oh it's a so, yeah now that i'm vaping on what i made yesterday it's getting really good because yeah. my coffee's growing and that mocha's growing too i was going to ask you how your mix came out oh i'm loving it I've been vaping it most of the day. And <laughs> at first I'm like, I think I'm going to have to up that mocha flavor from Wonder Flavors. But now that it's later in the day, I'm tasting it more. That's I think good. It's growing a little bit. So good. Yeah. I, I love it when a plant comes through. You don't have to go back in and, and change things. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. I like it. So what do you want to do cream wise? A heavy cream, a heavy sweet cream, a lighter cream. I, I think a heavy sweet cream. I think maybe adding that marshmallow vanilla from one on one also. Because it's got like a thick, a thick. That thick mouthfeel, baby. Texture. Yeah. Hi, Scott. Scott. Um, somebody said, what, James? I don't know if you're talking about the James. It's friction, if that's what we're talking about. I don't see the what James. It's from Cap and Spicy. Oh. Uh, James was was talking about the highest Nick salt in Canada is 25 oh, my milligram. Bad. Never mind. Never and the mind. highest free base is 12. I'm in another world. Okay. And Cap and Spicy is saying Canada's Nick Cap is 20. But I, I think the 20 is for regular nicotine, if I'm not mistaken. I think the Nick. Nick salt, I think, might be 25. Yeah, I know the Canada, they're going after the flavors next, supposedly. Dark yes, Star liquids? No. Dark you have? Star. I haven't heard of that. A Dark Star, yeah. I th yeah, I think back in the day, right? Like a long time ago? No, they're still around in the UK. Are they? In the UK. Yeah, I hear that other guys talk about them. Hmm. They steal recipes, yeah. <laughs> Hi, Daryl. How are you? Um, okay, so do you want to add? What do you think about the marshmallow vanilla? Yes or no? Oh, isn't it different? Yeah, let's let's uh, get Tam involved. What do you like for a, a heavy sweet cream, Tam? Um, whatever's like easy to get to. <laughs> <laughs> whatever's I'm closest teasing. to me. <laughs> I'm teasing. Now, um, if I was doing this, well, you know. There's so many out now that are so good. Um, and we know the, um, the, what about, I don't know how the French vanilla from Wonder Flavors, how does that, 
we I think we use some of that in our in your ice cream base, didn't we, Wendy? Or um, that was the Italian gelato. No, it was the Italian gelato. Um, I know it. Oh, and then there's the. You know what else I heard is also nice for just a cream, is the whipped cream from. SSA. No, from Wonder Flavors. Oh, oh okay. Yeah, theirs the, is real good too. The whipped yeah, cream I love fresh. That whipped cream. So yeah. What? The whipped cream fresh. Yes. I love that stuff. Actually, that's. <laughs> I need to get a big bottle of that. We could do some the marshmallow vanilla and the and the wonder flavors of whipped, whipped cream, cream, fresh, whipped cream yeah. fresh. Okay, so we've got the, now the holiday spice. Do you guys both have holiday spice or no? Um, it's in the bin. <laughs> <laughs> well, because I can't have anything with cinnamon, and the holiday spice is the only one that has the spices in it that doesn't have cinnamon, so it's the only one I can use. If we want to bump up the spice on it, which I think for the for the latte, I think we should because of the what coffee. What about and eggnog? We can use that, but I I never use my holiday spices. I'm not sure I understand. Well, don't uh, worry about it. <laughs> Let me try to explain it to her then. <laughs> you try your holiday spice and then get back to At me. At least she doesn't embarrass you this time. <laughs> I know she just like. What? All right, she's let's, a, she's let's always wanting me to explain things, and she's supposed to be Siri. Like, come on, she's Wendy, got the whole fucking you. internet. Wendy, I told you about those websites. <laughs> I know, oh, I know. I keep trying to tone it down, but it's hey, like Albany, you know, you have to you there. have to wean yourself off little by little. And we can add the eggnog to it, but but um, if you use the holiday spice, you got to use it like right, really sparingly. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, okay. Yeah, let's do it. You want I'm, to add I'm that one? Okay. I'll set up the recipe. I don't have holiday, but I'll just do bake BTA BTA bakery spice. See, he's yeah, like, I can't do, do it, and he's not even gonna do it. Well, I'm gonna do it, but I'll, I'm just gonna add a tiny amount of. He's gonna do something different. I think they're kind of similar. No, I just can't have that cinnamon. And I really, really wanted something that tasted just like a Starbucks. Hey, Doggo. Hi, Fitty. I forgot about you earlier. I think it was all good, though. Cindy says, no spice. You guys are nuts. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta have a spicy latte. Yeah, but it's not really um, spicy but, like in, like, you know, spicy let Cheetos. Let me see. Um, I have all of TFA over here. Let's see. Let me do this. I gotta take a sniff. It's been a minute. Found it. Um, don't be back over there in here. Um, D, A, B, C, D. Whipped cream fresh. Boy, I can't believe it was in the front. <laughs> wow. Mine's probably going to be in a box anyway. So. Probably. Yeah. <laughs> You had a hell of a time finding that one flavor last week. Yeah, and it was right in my face, too. Oh, my God. Don't turn into me. <laughs> no, it is there. Okay, so we've got the pumpkin. I'm BSO. We've got the espresso. Oh, the floor. Got the marshmallow. Vanilla. One-on-one. Um, we've got the... Holiday spice, yeah, here we go. And then we've got oh, well, okay, so on that one. Spice right. girls, that's yeah, yeah. Spice girls. One and a half of the espresso. Oh. Oh. Marshmallow vanilla, what do you want to put it at? Oh. It's coming up at 1.5. We want to be able to taste it, right? Yeah. What do you think? Uh, well, it comes up at 1.5. I just figured we can go with that. Sure. And then whipped cream fresh is coming up at 1. That sounds good. So it should make a nice cream. And the holiday spice, I put it at 0.2. Sounds like a plan to me. All right. Let me save this and send it to y'all. Um, yeah. Um, 
Fiddy, um, Addy's dropped it in a couple of times already. So I'll yeah. drop it in again. There you go. There you go. Ronnie. Okay, well, I'm doing my live stream, so I can't really see it right now since I'm actually doing my live stream, but thank you. Chameleon, how you doing? Let me go over here to my rest. Let me look at something. Um, um, pomegranate. I'm getting there. Pomegranate? Pomegranate, <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> we were talking about that yesterday. Uh, um, is this it? No, that's Sabayon. We like that Sabayon. I, no, I didn't use it in that. Um, Have you played with uh, that VSO Sabayon yet? Tim? Oh my gosh, that was so funny. Sabayon? What? It's, a wine, it's like a wine based custard. No, but I need that. Oh, it's really good. Oh, that sounds like something I would really like. Yeah, I need that. Hey, I guys, have another in the day where I'm in our chat order. Now I can start uh, looking for my stuff. Let me see. Oh, Love Shack Shake. Let me see what I uh, use. I'm thinking I should have started in the front because I haven't found <laughs> oh, no, I didn't use yep. that. Espresso was in the second row and I started in the back oh, row. I should have espresso out already. Yeah, I got a big bowl of that. Espresso is okay. ready. And I should have. Espresso, got pumpkin, one-on-one. Yeah. I gotta find bakery spice. There it is. I know, same here, Fiddy. Marshmallow, vanilla. Oh, I gotta go pull that. Whipped cream, fresh. Holiday spice TPA. Holiday spice is here. Wait, do we have the? Does somebody have a link to the recipe or a? Yeah, it's in the it's in the Zoom chat. Oh, good. All right, thank you so much. Okay. Oh, oh you can just uh, edit it to whatever you like. Perfect. Thank you. Back over here. Hey, Go I'm to this in one of these. Perfect. Let me check. Holiday spice. Um, adapt this. Also. I'm just curious if um, bakery spice and holiday spice are the same. <laughs> Um, I can pretty much tell you no. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, bakery spice is more AP-ish. Okay. Yeah. A-penis? <laughs> yeah, it's more A-penis in it. Yeah. But it's got, it's a spicy penis. <laughs> <laughs> With All a right. big tip. Yeah, so and this is a uh, spiciness with no penis, so <laughs> you kind of let down. Um, okay, I gotta pull my vanilla, I, all about marshmallow, how and the pumpkin. God, remember when the internet first started, came around, there was hardly any information. Now there's like too much information. I know. <laughs> It takes so long to find stuff now. You know, first you have to get through all the bullshit ads. Drop, don't trip. Pumpkin and the, I think I just pumpkin. You used to be able to put stuff um, in quotation marks and it would search for that exact term, but. Yeah, but that was too easy, so they took it away. Yeah. No, this is too easy. This is it. Something's weird. Okay. Um. Oh, what am I doing? I could just go look right at the notes on eloquent recipes. Duh. Duh. Jeez. Uh, <laughs> Duh. I know. Oh my God. Don't ask. Take me a minute to find this. Resources. Flavor list. I'm looking for holiday spice. Right here, here we go. Um, I'm gonna pull the. I do love that um, bakery spice. So. This flavoring has been reported to crack plastic tanks. <laughs> oh wow! What flavor is that? Holiday spice. Oh wow! 
Yeah, we can't use it. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> well, then that was a waste. <laughs> All right, I think I have Search form. Am I, am I logged in? Yep. Okay. Notes. There we go. Mostly nutmeg. Yeah, that, remember we looked it up on that website. There, there that's, were yeah, we looked at the MSD app. Yeah, that's why I said that that one would be good. Mostly we, nutmeg. We for sure knew that it didn't have anything in it. But I can't find my oh, damn wood here. Okay. All right. Okay, so now I got to look up bakery spice. I can tell, I can smell the clove in the bakery spice. Oh, I crack tanks too. All I have to do is drop it on the floor. Well, actually, <laughs> flip it over on a, a wood counter. I can crack it. And I was thinking one day, I don't, I haven't cracked tanks in years. And then I thought about it. Well, probably because I just used squonks for years. So that's why I didn't crack tanks. And right. Tanks. <laughs> you haven't and had anything then, with glass on it. Yeah. Notes. Notes. Okay. Oh, it's good thing we, did. good thing you don't have um, bakery spice, Wendy. Yeah. It's a blend of cinnamon, anise, and brown sugar. Yeah. Oh, great. All the flavors I can't have. Awesome. I can't find my whipped cream fresh. Oh, I have one more box. Yeah. One more box to go with. So if it's mostly nutmeg, I just use some VSO nutmeg. Wait, this is banana box. Okay. I can see. All right. I'm not going to. Well, that other stuff sounds pretty good to me, though. We could just try the nutmeg if you want. I think I have that one. No, I want you to uh, experience the flavor and see what it's like. Dang it. Sorry. Espresso. Where am I? Where I'm going to experience this flavor if I can't find the damn whipped cream. Oh, you can't find it? Oh, but I have things everywhere. That's why. Oh, no. Whipped cream. Got to put a little uh, VSO sweet in there, too. Yeah, I think so. What is spice at? A point. There. I love this cappuccino. I mean, what? No, why do I want to call it? It's espresso. From from BSO, it's my favorite. Yeah, like, so good. Mm -hmm. We had fun on uh, mixers helping mixers last night. Yeah, that was fun. I'm so happy that show's staying alive and back on YouTube yeah, again. Yeah, exactly. And I I thank Zippy all the time for keeping because I was not good about coming to help and but I was just it just really I wasn't in a good place to I don't know my fault <laughs> but you well, know at least she did it and it's good yeah I sure miss Mike he's a good guy oh last week oh my I had a rough week last week but and I've thought a few different times, I sure as heck wish Mike was here because he was like, you know, I can message him and anytime he would be like, well, you know, Tim, <laughs> he always had some kind of like wisdom he was or super positive and super helpful. Yes. And yes, he just loved to help people. Yeah, he was always like, well, you know, Tam. And he would just pretty much put it like it was, you know, not in a mean way. Yeah. Or I was like, yeah, you know, you're right. I'm just a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you know, <laughs> being Tam, a if, baby or being whatever. And I mean, that goes for anybody out there. Wendy, Tam, you guys in chat, you guys ever need somebody to talk to? I'm around. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. I appreciate it. But I tell you, one night it was um, 
last week, um, Pugs was around and I chatted with him and he was awesome. Like he, he made me laugh and that was good. That's good. Pugs is a good so, guy. Yeah, too. He is. He's a good guy. Marshmallow. Okay. Am I, here we go. Marshmallow and all. He, and he pretty much said, and he told it like it was, he said, you're having a pity party. <laughs> <laughs> and you know and I always say it's okay to have a pity party once in a while you know but you gotta like move on after you have have it and then move on and you it, it's okay just don't dwell on it right too long yeah what is this 20 mils I Oh, Wendy's got a picture on there and everything for our pumpkin spice latte. Look at that, Tam. We're on the we're on the big screen. And oh, nice. She's prepared with that. Yeah, yeah. This is we have the best family in the world. Exactly. That's why today I was like, I feel, and I messaged Zippy, and I'm like, apologize for being so crabby the past couple of weeks. And she was like, no worries. But I'm like, I feel like a new woman. I'm like, well, no, not really a new woman, but. I said, not really new. But I said to myself, I need to take advantage of feeling good and help people while I can't, you know, and this is, you know, whatever I can do, I'm going to do it. And that's what I want to do. So, well, we appreciate it. I mean, being here isn't really, I mean, I love spending time with everybody. So that's just, I don't know where I'm at. <laughs> I don't know. I, did I put the holiday spice in? I don't know. Oh, okay. God. I still haven't found my damn whipped cream yet. Now they're wanting to know where you got pictures of us from. <laughs> no, that's actually the the screenshot screen grab from the YouTube uh, live stream. I just put in the link to the live stream. Yeah, are they spicy picture? Yeah, it's spicy like pumpkin spice. <laughs> Not that spicy. No. <laughs> Did I put in pumpkin? I need two pipe bags. Okay. Really. So when's deer hunting open up down there? So John gets out of your hair. Oh, it's open now. That's oh, what it? Tim was. Or advocate for liberty kept asking like where's the bug did he get it because he um um is so gung-ho about it and no it oh yeah actually this weekend was gun season opening weekend and so john was bummed because he didn't get one yet and um i'm like well just hold on because you have the past few years when you shot a deer you didn't get it until like a couple of weeks in. Oh, that's you're right. right. Yeah. No, you're right. So he was getting know. nervous. Yeah, I'm like. I remember okay. that. Yeah. I mean, he is like a a kid with that stuff. Like. Well, that's good. He has a passion like that. Like. Um, oh yeah, it is. Thank God his passion's not doing laundry, Richard, right? Yeah. Anyway. Thank God his passion is not doing the laundry. <laughs> oh, well, no, he does the laundry, too. <laughs> I know, but he always messes it up. I know, and I have to yell at him. <laughs> Did you hang my shirt up like that? <laughs> so now I hide my clothes so he can't do them sometimes that I do them. <laughs> I remember your, your daughter yelled at him for screwing up her underwear. Yeah, doing okay. her bra in the wash. <laughs> <laughs> and he knew better than that, too. That's what's so bad. Point two. Find oh, Wendy, well, find it. Tip, he, I'll well, send you some venison. Or you can come get it, either one. You're welcome. I still have some from last year in the freezer. Um, point three. No. I am so confused. I don't know what to fit in this bottle and what I have it. I got to start again. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I really don't. I don't know. You could use one-on-one -on -one whipped cream, Wendy, or sweet cream, or... Yeah, I know, but I really want to find, like, where my freaking thing is. Oh, found it. The first oh, one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> See? I was just going to say it's in the new release. 
Is it in the first box? Okay. That I couldn't find. Later, coconut. Coconut. Bye, coconut. Noise. Be safe at work. Good night, Kristen. Hi, Kristen. Right, let me figure out what the things were again. Okay, so we got the marshmallow and the holidays. Holiday, that should be easy. Oh, yeah, see, I kind of grew up on it too, kind of, but my mom didn't like it. But my dad hunted all the time. But I swore I wasn't going to marry a deer hunter. And I didn't <laughs> initially, but I'm with one now. <laughs> Guess what I can't find now? Uh, espresso. Not the holiday price. Oh, wait. Okay, I'm not putting it in until you... Until you <laughs> <laughs> it should be here because I remember buying it specifically for this. And I really think I had it organized, but I cannot... I can't find it now. Um, that would be maybe in this one. I know it should be there. It's TPA. All my TPAs are already right there, right? Yeah. Okay. Unless I put it in here. I think I'm in really close on my base. I don't know. I never come close, but like the last few mixes. Uh, where you like put it in perfect? I, well, yeah. It's, it's, it's usually always over by like at least a half, half a gram, you know? It's just the base. <laughs> okay, so I mean, you know, when it's so heavy, it's hard to, when you're dumping it out of this big bottle. Okay, you want to just switch to eggnog? I'm not going to spend the rest of the show freaking just looking this up. Eggnog? Okay. We could do um, VSO nutmeg? I don't know if I have that. Yeah, I should have that one. VSO stuff over here. Because that's what that is, is mostly nutmeg. At least that's what it says on ELR. Yeah. I love the VSO because all my VSOs are in one spot. That I know. Yeah, I used to I used to go hunting every year for years and years and years, Tam. Oh yeah. And then when I lost the job I had before this one, like 13, 14, 15 years ago, I you know, I was just you, you know, you lose a job, it's super stressful. Yeah. You know, they're saying your your the plant's gonna close and uh I just didn't feel like hunting that year and I and I realized I didn't miss it. So Wow. See, that was my dad for years. He hunted all the time. And then all of a sudden he just quit. I don't know what exactly happened, but my mom was happy about it. <laughs> I do miss uh, the tenderloins wrapped in bacon cooked on the grill though. I sure miss those. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to have to get a pipette for this. Okay. So how much of the nutmeg is coming out of 0.25? That should be fine, right? Yeah. Okay. How much? All right, I resaved it with nutmeg. Sam, can you see it's a nutmeg? Oh, you heard, Tam? Oh, fudge. No fudge, nutmeg. <laughs> I know, but I was trying not to say really bad words, so I said fudge. <laughs> instead instead of nutmeg? Instead of, never mind. <laughs> So I'm like, what am I wow, trying Mallory. to say for nothing? <laughs> okay, hold on. Let me turn it around. Okay. Come on. Let me get by. Don't fall. Or I will say the really bad word. <laughs> if, the, if this tray falls. Yeah, that here. would suck. That would suck. Yeah. And now my foot's stuck in something. Okay, we got it. I got it. You got it? I got it. I'm not going to... Have a disaster. That would be fun. Good okay. job, Tam. Yeah. Oh, I'm. I need about two more. Another room built on here. Um, I'm looking for nutmeg here. And 
Oh, here, let me pull this out. I'll want that later. Mints. It's funny this 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 old tugboat V two still got like a coil I built like two years ago in it. Oh wow. <laughs> I need to play with some of these. This smells good. I remember mm. I sorted them by type that day. I was, oh, here it is. Not my right there. See? Yay. Yeah, I sorted them by type because um, I was trying to pull doubles out so I can send Zippy some. And I did, yeah. Because I said <laughs> she deserved some flowers. <laughs> and that's in her and some garlic and stuff that's in her so oh I didn't get the pipe out oh, God. you know when DeMillan watches a replay she's going to do like growl when growl comes on yep you know she will <laughs> be like growl nobody heard me growl now, I, gotta, I gotta message her and see how she liked the, the pumpkin oh. cheesecake I wonder if she took it with her that's a good question. Oh, now it's going to come out. Okay. I knew she flew, right? So you can only bring so many, so yeah. many liquids. Um, so how much of this nutmeg am I putting in? Sorry. 0.25. Uh, 0 0.25. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Well, I'm glad you had a good day before you uh, you couldn't get on YouTube there, Wendy. I'm glad your day went. Yeah, good I know, well, right? Actually. No, it was a it was kind of a sucky day at work, but then I was like, all right, I got off on time, which is the first time in forever. Yeah. I'm like, okay, I'm gonna sit down. I'm gonna relax. I had a little something to eat, so I'm not starving while I'm doing the live stream. And then I can eat later. I was like all for it, waked up for set, uh, set up. I was like, what? I was like, Look at me go. And then I, I know it. You jinxed yourself go. by uh, by good time management. <laughs> <laughs> That's probably why I, th I threw the whole universe off. Yeah. Okay. Um, it's seven. That means like. Okay. Good. So I just dropped the link in there if anybody has it, some extra time to just to turn in a testimonial. Yeah. I keep meaning to oh, do that. I want to do that. Maybe one day this week I'm going to do that. Yeah. I'll send you the link on um on the Instagrams. Oh, yeah. yeah. That way it's really in my face. That's a good idea. Because <laughs> <laughs> I do I forget stuff. Yeah. No, you don't. Um, okay. I need this. Oh, I got to put the mental health links in here. Yes. This is kind of nice. I never, I'm never the first one to get my mix done. Oh, I'm done. I just got to shake. You guys are just always waiting on me usually. Yeah, I would have been done, know. but I forgot. I lost track of where I was. <laughs> and then I had to start over. <laughs> This is yeah. technically her second one. So she was way down before. Yeah, that's true. She's way out of all of us. Yeah, and what's weird is this is so unusual. Usually I'm still looking for flavors. <laughs> you know, I mean, I'm still like, oh, Lord, I don't know where this one is. And Yeah, so if anybody's struggling, um, there's a couple of Discord chats. I just put in a link. One's in the UK and one's in the US. And Tim is one of them, Advocate for Liberty. So there's usually people always in those discords if you if you need somebody to chat know. with. Okay. Well, wow, we had to turn the furnace on today. <laughs> huh? We had to turn the furnace on today. It oh, was. Wow. 68. That's a lucky thing to do. Yeah, it was 68 in the house. We let it go. I mean, it's pretty good going to this late until October. Lucky? 
Yep. It's usually on before this. It's like 90 something here. <laughs> like I have the it's AC on low and a freaking oscillating fan and I'm still hot. Oh. Mm -hmm. I know my poor wife is always having hot flashes. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Emmer, yeah. The Millen does I love thought her, it was just uh, me, but it wasn't. <laughs> her Oculus. No, she's visiting her sister out of state. She's in Oklahoma. Yeah, she messaged me to remind me. She's like, don't forget. Smells good. One in a bottle. That one's empty. That's good. Right, hold on. Make this a lot of lotty. <laughs> what do you got queued up for dinner tonight, Wendy? I don't know. I'll probably have some cereal. Don't you do it? I'm probably making nothing. I'm tired. It's been a long, short day. Well, plus I was having issues with my middle daughter yesterday, and she was mad at my daughter, my other daughter, so she blocked me on everything. Oh. Like, it really hurt my feelings. I, I literally went to sleep crying. So I didn't sleep well last night. Hi, Friction. Oh, you're... But yeah, she got mad at her. She, she blocked me on the phone. She blocked me on Facebook. She blocked me on... Oh, um, I've done Instagram. that to my mother before. I've never done that. Because God forbid something happens to somebody, there's no way to get a hold of her. Yeah. Yep. I mean, and life is so short that, like, you can be going yeah. out to the store and that'll be your last time, you know? Yeah, right? absolutely. I, I'm really against... Well, the thing is, is that we were talking about her new furniture she's getting. Then she went off about something that Esther did, like, six months ago. Then she blocked us all. And then out of the blue today, she's like, hey, do you want this purse? Maybe she was feeling guilty and... Just trying to reach out to you, maybe. I told her she has bipolar like me. She doesn't believe me. <laughs> and yeah, that doesn't prove it. <laughs> friction, I'm happy to help. I love you, brother. I'm, Hi, I'm happy to be in a spot where you I can help. You know I love him. Oh, oh, Tim said it was 40 degrees. He's Tim's in Vermont. It's never going to be 40 here. Where if it is, I? it's like um, a fluke. That means that the world is in. Oh, igloo. Damn it, spicy. Yeah, I think uh, it was supposed to get to 47 last night, I think. It was in the 50s here in Georgia. That's pretty damn cold, Georgia. Yeah. I think we're uh, going to head down to Georgia next summer, Tam. Oh, yeah? Might have to message you and see if, if you're around where we're going. Yeah, we're that would going be a, awesome. An hour away from Atlanta, someplace. Yeah, I'm like 45 minutes from Atlanta. Okay, so I hope it's the same way from the from the city. I think they yeah. live west. They live east of Atlanta, where we're going. Okay, um, my kids live east, right? Yes, they live east, like Gwinnett County, Lawrenceville. Um, that, um, I'm, I'm more South, um, okay. my parents are North, <laughs> so, but it's all, it doesn't matter. It's all like, you know, a big watermelon circle that goes around Atlanta. So I'm just not looking forward to dealing with the traffic. I hear the traffic is horrid there. Oh, it's, it's hard. I always tell John, I want to move closer in because I miss I, I'm more of a I don't want to say I'm a city girl but I'm more I'm not a country girl, like woodsy girl <laughs> well, yeah. it's nice to be just far enough away where you can still like in 20 minutes yeah. get to, get to all the stuff that you need yeah and yeah. that's the thing in here it's like to get to a grocery store, we got to go like half an hour. Yeah, let's see, that drives me crazy. And our internet sucks. Yeah, because you're so far out. Yeah. And I just... Oh, Friction's little girl's being a little cranky. 
Oh, Aww. oh, fuck, Shen, I meant to tell you. I want a picture. I want to see a new picture of her. Yeah, the picture of your family is, is beautiful on your uh, GoFundMe. It's a good picture of, of your kids. He's an old, an old picture. <laughs> Captain Spicy says, oh, well, I was kidding, Addy. I don't live in an igloo. I didn't figure you did. Spicy. <laughs> Tell me what you want, what you really, really want. Daryl says, just thinking about packing up all those bottles you got on the wall. <laughs> what, mine? Yeah, oh, no, if you're you're moving. Ever, yeah, if you ever had to move, oh my God. Oh, I don't even want to see. That's another reason John's like, if we ever move, I'm not doing this. <laughs> <laughs> That's so when you know. hire a kid or something like that, and you're like, here, come here. I give you something because you're not going to break them. Just be like, here, here's a pot. Yeah. An advocate for, yeah, we, I can't get a DoorDash. I can't get, we can't even get pizza delivery here. We can't get shit. No, see, I, I wouldn't be able to live like that. I get groceries. See, that's me. I've, I, oh, I grew up like that, like this in the, in the rural, like boonies. And I swore I would never live like that. And here I am. <laughs> <laughs> But you know what? I also swore I would never live in an unhappy relationship. And again, and I'm not really. I mean, I'm just dealing with normal. Only when he's home know. for a long period of time. <laughs> <laughs> just when, yeah, when he's home because he got hurt at work and and he's driving me crazy every five minutes. What are you doing now? That just dropped. Where are you going? I'm going from the bedroom to here. Where are you going? <laughs> And a poor, poor, your poor husband was so bored. He was. <laughs> I like when, you when you're get cooking a and they're like, like something. I like when you're cooking and they go, "What are you doing?" And I'll be like, "Doing laundry." Yeah. <laughs> okay. Where honey, are you going? Hey. I'm going to Walmart. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like that. It's like oh, I was going for a walk. I'm standing there cooking. And yeah, then but... I'll have the door open in here, and he'll just stand there and stare. <laughs> And if I don't have it, I always say I'm going to have a mirror up, like, so I can see when he's sneaking up on me. <laughs> we love, we love your husband, John. Oh, I, I do too, but he, I, oh, I do too. And he loves me, but we always say that's our foreplay is our. <laughs> You're bantering. Great? Yeah, bantering. That's a good word, bantering. Because I'll say something and he'll say something back. And I'm like, I am not arguing with you. I, he goes, I'm not arguing. <laughs> well, then you're bickering something. <laughs> so, Eric, he says, I'm 30 minutes either way to the grocery store, but there's a Dollar General five minutes for me for the emergencies. Uh, well, yeah, we do have a Dollar General, but you can't walk through it. And half the time it's empty and it's just dirty. Uh, and it's no it's just not the same yeah now we're uh, shopping for us and we're shopping for my mom so it's double duty now oh god that we're getting used to it though and that's the thing i miss my it's to go see my not that i need to go see my mom but i do love my dad i would love, love to go see my dad more often and my brother um and they're like two hours north with traffic and it's not really that far, but with traffic and yeah. you have to go through Atlanta to get there. It's just a long way. Well, make some time to see him because like when he was saying, you never know. Yeah, yeah, you never know. And I was thinking about that this weekend and they're like in their, how old are they? If I'm 50, I'm, it's so weird because I had to log in with my age today and it said 50. I was like, thanks. Yeah. Sam's like, damn it, fuckers. <laughs> really? I didn't know. Thank you. Um, but to um, yeah, so they're like in their 70s. And my brother, he was born mentally disabled. He's five years older than me. So he's like a uh I don't know, 10-year-old still living at home. Wow. But he is the coolest person you will ever meet in the whole world. Like, so I always say he has always been my inspiration when I got sick and had the stroke and everything. Right. 
to know that I, if he could do what he does, I can do it, you know? Correct. So mm-hmm. he is the coolest. So I miss uh, him and I always say, I want to wish I could go see him more. I tell you that all the time. I really, I, I really look to your strengths sometimes, Dan. Oh, thank you. Well, I got it from my family and stuff because they're. Oh, thanks, Emmer. <laughs> I'm going to be 62 in December. Social Security. Oh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Already got that. Ready. I'm 25, so shipping it. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah. You about ready to try this one? You shake it? Yeah. I, where is Oh, here it is. Wait, no, here it is. My RTA. I thought you were. Um, t- Tam likes to boop Steve's uh, boop Steve stuff too sometimes. Yeah, you just put it. Yeah. And it warms it right up. (laughs) Yeah, it'll warm it up. Yeah. It's so much better than a crock pot. (laughs) Yeah, I get my free show after all, Wendy. (laughs) I could have I could have had that done in three days. (laughs) Oh yeah. I was so mad. Well one of the one of the boys from the UK show that we do or whatever i don't know they they were making comments about my boobs on the show and i was like um listen guys you better stop your bullshit <laughs> <laughs> tell them tam so, I, I put them in check girl <laughs> says this is the internet we're all 21 ish <laughs> yeah, exactly <laughs> but you know i'm proud to be 50 because i was wondering if i would make it to 50 yeah mm-hmm. i didn't know how long I would have after I survived. Oh, I'm so and sorry, Jeff. Jeff says he had to move in with his mother. She keeps falling. Last Sunday, Phil ended up with almost 20 stitches to her hand. Oh, and damn it. And she fell oh. again today. Oh, you're good. You're a good man, I'm Jeff, so to be there for her. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Cindy. Thanks, Mallory. Mm-mm-mm. What up, Tom? Right, I'm putting it on the RDA, RTA, whatever it is. RDA, RDA. Yeah, that's the other um, RTA. That thing. Ready? Oh, well, now I got to put a lid on it or else I'll get like that. Yeah, don't kiss the coils. Yeah, no, I don't want to do that. Okay. That's only for texture. <laughs> <laughs> Friction Friction sent you a picture. We do cheers, Tam. Cheers. Oh, okay. Cheers. Oh, cheers. <laughs> oh cheers oh i'm not, I'm not going to the <laughs> here we go oh i lost it what the hell mm, yum i miss new york cheesecake Cook the fire i'm in this new york cheesecake what i apparently locked it <laughs> Oh, just plus or minus at the same time. How'd yours turn out, Wendy? Here we go. I don't see the uh, telltale smile. All right. Okay. (laughs) Got it? Okay. Yeah. Waiting for Tam. Well, we know the coffee's going to grow, and I'm hoping that the cream grows, too. It should, yes. I think it came out good. On a first taste, I think it's good. Yeah. I it's gonna like be it. probably the same meal. <laughs> yeah, it's been yeah, it's off the shake, it's very nice, definitely. Yeah. It's not, yeah. So I think it's gonna grow really nice. And it's not too much spice, but the pumpkin's coming through. And that's gonna grow a little bit too. So I think it came out good. Mm. If you guys yeah. are interested, it's already in chat. You guys can try it. <laughs> yeah, we're an older stream. That's cool. I love it. Yeah, we're here. <laughs> I'll put it in chat again. There we go. Spice, where is your... Oh, and now we can... Oh, I got it. Yeah, I still have a copy. There we go. Be like, Tam. <laughs> there it is. I can't we'll believe both post that. it. <laughs> we'll both post it we're just going to post it all over the place actually you know what I'll do I'm going to pin it on VC and then I'll go post it so it's everywhere 
Oh, I missed it earlier. Somebody is having uh, breakfast for dinner tonight. I forgot who said that. It's me. That's all. <laughs> Let me see. I we're like do, we're probably going to do Kellogg's Raisin Bran again. <laughs> but what I've been liking to do lately, which is so funny, because I used to like it because it was crispy. You know, the brand is real. And I hated when it got soggy. Now I make it. I let it sit. I vape a while until it gets mushy. And then I... <laughs> Addy, what are you drinking? It looks like a bottle of liquor. Like it's um some grape crush uh, water oh, flavor. Oh, okay, yeah, I do that with my water a lot. Yeah, those things. Yeah, I don't put a lot. It's, like it's a really that it looks purple. It looks yellow, but it's purple. Yeah, yeah, uh, it looks like the bottles my grandmother used to have. She would take a swig before bed. <laughs> <laughs> is that, so is that moonshine? Moonshine? <laughs> God, yeah, no, I I I can't do much alcohol. It just makes me tired anymore. Yeah, I think yeah, you like this. This is good. Pumpkin yeah. spice latte. Heck yeah. I like it a lot, actually. I really do. You gotta send this to DeMillon. So DeMillon can have it ready for next week when she comes. DeMillon's gonna be busy, girl. <laughs> yeah, yeah I know. To... She'll she... be behind on her Oculus training. Yep. Miss I wonder, I wonder if she um, her sister or Angela let her bring it with her. I don't know. Sweet strawberry turned out. Sweet. Maybe to show her. Maybe she did. They would have somebody to play with then. Would right. Be, you add extra but they only had the one. So I think they would need two, right? Play right. Two. This is good. Yeah, it's good. We'll that try does that sound again pretty next cool. week. But this you pumpkin can... cheesecake is fire. They have that game where you can get dropped off anywhere in the world randomly and you have to figure out where the heck you are, that'd be pretty cool. Uh, no. <laughs> oh, but the virtual... Yeah, the thing. Ocula. Yeah, the VR. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Didn't DeMillion get those? Some of yep. those? Yeah, she's been playing. Yeah, you can get the wrong by accident. <laughs> <laughs> I was watching... Um, what's his name? I can't remember his name now. Scuba? But yes, one night, and he was talking about them, and she was in the chat, and she was getting them. Yeah, so I mean. yeah, we love scuba. Scuba's in here yeah, sometimes. But I'm the same way, Fitty. Fitty, I don't do alcohol no more because I think it's water. I think a bottle of wine is just water, so I chug it. <laughs> so I don't do it. <laughs> and four setups. I like this a lot. Oh, nice advocate. Lady Liberty makes pancakes from scratch. They have those for dinner sometimes. Ooh. Not, yeah. Well, I'm going to come there. It's so much the easier for me to do the cereal. I'm actually almost out of the cereal because I have had that a couple nights. I love, sometimes I have my, uh, gosh, it's Kellogg's, but it's not like, it's not a kid cereal. It's the kind that's. Raisin Bran? It, ha no, it has berries in it. it oh, looks like the, 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 the um, special K with berries? Yes, yeah, special K with berries. And I get, Look at I get suggested out of every cereal out there. That's yes, amazing. that's it. It was me doing this. She just knew it. Yeah. <laughs> and then I get the Greek. That wouldn't have gotten me. Yeah, I know. I get the Greek yogurt with strawberry strawberries in the bottom, and I mix it with it. Oh, and it oh. is my favorite snack in the whole world, and sometimes my dinner. And I just love it's my favorite thing ever. I need to make a vape out of it, but I love it. I've yeah, been having okay. um, cottage cheese with peaches for like snacks lately. I just went. I haven't had it in years, and all of a sudden now that's all I have: like cottage cheese and peaches. It's it's cheese and pizza? What? Cottage cheese with peaches. Oh, oh I love Oh, yeah. Speaking of, well, I did tell this yesterday. John found me some muscadines in the woods the other day. And I love muscadines from when I was a kid. And oh, they wow. were on a vine near where he hunts, where the people live. Mm -hmm. um, and they showed him and said, you can pick all you want. And he brought me home like a few vines. Wow. And, oh, they're so delicious. Oh, my gosh. I mean, it took my breath away to eat them because of the memories, you know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. From my grandmother's house. 
they're just i've never had them they're so they're just like really big grapes they taste just like grapes or what uh no well they're sweet like grapes similar to a grape but a little bit more tart tasting it's just a unique ex, a unique taste um and they I make wine to, they make wine from them too yeah miss muscadel wine my parents made it one time um I think, yeah, but they don't drink. <laughs> but anyway, um, yeah, they can make wine from it. Um, but it's a hard flavor to emulate or to. I've read that companies have tried to re emulate it or whatever, and it's yeah, like reproduce it uh, chemically. Yeah. Exactly. That's it. Yeah. Uh, but it's just got this flavor. Like a lot of it, you eat it, but you have to spit the skins out because they're so tough. The skins are really tough on them. Like a grape, you can eat the skins. You can right. Eat but a muscadine, the skins are really tough. But I love them. Oh my God. Um, made wild grape wine a couple of years back. Super sweet. Super strong. Oh, I bet it would be. I would have drank it like water. <laughs> oh nice spicy yeah i don't know I, I, as far as i know i mean i don't know how carolina extract is doing if they're still shipping i think they ran out and somebody was saying i think in the group but i know if you email wizard labs i think you can still get it from there and i and i think the losi yeah. labs is still selling it yeah, it's some called something different. Yeah, they are. There's a couple of places on on the what group. Oh gosh, beginners DIY e liquid or whatever. She has a place where they're they have links to everybody. That's oh cool. Have, that's yeah. good to know. You can still get um, giant giant vapes. Oh, um, cool. That's, that's that good. It, yeah. That was one of the ones I remember seeing. Yeah. Like those guys, a lot of, a lot of kudos for staying in business. Giant. Yeah, exactly. And then the hardware companies that will still ship to us. Is, I appreciate a lot. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, nice, Fiddy. Thank you. Yeah, I'm set for a good while, but I just want to, I always try to bring it up for oh, people okay. who need it. Oh, Ristol says muscadine pie is amazing. Oh, really? Did your grandma oh. ever make pies? Who said this? Ristol. Oh, Rist like, well, are you going to, will you make me one? <laughs> I ain't getting enough muscadines for that. Oh my gosh, that sounds amazing. I wonder if there's some place I can go get one that would be amazing no i need to go see max max gave up on cooking with you wendy you're not oh, cooking with no it's just on the live stream days oh, i got it i can't wait um i don't blame him i, mean, I don't either forever. oh my god what's going on um Frank thinks you're not doing a show. Yeah, we are. Oh, thanks, Scott. Yeah, Cloud Trucker says, um, do we like a chocolate vape? He said you just got, I guess it's a chocolate shortcake. Caramel. That sounds pretty Ooh, good. It is shortbread. That does sound good. Chocolate caramel shortbread. I love shortbread cookies. Oh, look at this. Oh, can I show... He won't care. Hold on. Hold on. Let me get this. <laughs> oh, the light's going to blare it in it. It is. Oh, that's uh, frictions? Yeah, and his Maybe. wife. They're so cute. Oh, my God. Why is the light blaring it so bad? Tilt it down a little bit. Down. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Aw. Just cute. Oh, my God. Beauty. Just that was yesterday, he said. 
Oh, uh, she, look at her eye. Oh my gosh. She's got her mama's eyes. Those so two cute. make cute babies. Oh, they do. That's for sure. Oh, she looks like a baby doll. Oh my gosh. I'm in love. <laughs> I'm in love. Oh my gosh. Awesome, Tim. I appreciate that. Thank you. I would still love to see you guys. Next time you guys want to take a road trip. Yep. And just make sure that you don't have at and so you don't get roaming charges. All right. <laughs> <laughs> or yeah, you have a, well, they're pretty, they're, I don't know if he's on the border with Canada, but Vermont has a pretty long border with Canada too. But don't have at and They love roaming charges. Yeah. I know. I used to work with them. Everybody called in about roaming charges. I just got a $400 bill. Yeah, I know dealing with AT&T, it's, it's kind of like buying a car. Well, let me, yeah. uh, I have to get approval from my manager. Hold, please. Yep. Yeah, because they can't, they can't just apply credits. They have to go through a long stream of people just to, just to do it. I think they finally got tired of me calling like after the 50th time. <laughs> I would do it. <laughs> yeah, this came out nice. It really did. I'm enjoying it a lot, actually. But I need to save it so I can see how it comes out. Yeah, I'm guessing three days, but I won't try it until next week. You coming on next week? Am I invited? Um, always. I told you it was an open invitation like I five know. months ago. But yeah, I will. I will. Do. Yeah, I will. <laughs> have fun. And he said, I think I'm going on. And I'm like, we have an open invitation. I'm like, okay. Yeah, I you. did mess I did message Wendy before. And yeah. I said I talked with Addie and and I'm gonna come on. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, after the good. last time talking to her, I was like, I'm just going to see if she shows up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the the last time I talked to you, you said that you were coming on. I was all excited, and then you didn't come on. I was like, oh, okay. He's I'll just wait this time. And then you showed up. See? I did. I've been shocking people lately. I know. You shocked me. I literally had a heart attack. I know because um, my uh, well, my show. Well, I've let um, Simon and Liam kind of take the reins of the of the YouTube part. Um, running the stream, yeah, running the stream and stuff. So it there. <laughs> so now it's like if Tam shows up, it's a miracle. But I've been showing up now, and it's just you know I think you get to a point where like. You just need a break. And I did. I just needed a break for a little bit. I can. And I got it. So I'm good now. And nice. All yeah. right. Well, we understand too. Yeah. I mean, you have bad days and good days too. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. Well, that too. Yeah. And I think the trucker thing really threw me for a loop. It really did. Yeah. You don't realize it until, you know, it just really like was. And you, you know, know you, you get a little older. You, you, you learn to appreciate the, you know, the people you have in your life. Exactly. While you have them, you know. Exactly. Exactly. And the only reason last week was a bad week was because it was that PTSD thing coming up on the anniversary of my yeah. brain hemorrhage surgery thing. Yeah. And I hit that this weekend. So now we're, and usually it hits me like way before a week before. So I'm doing really much better with that. So, and I um, loved your Instagram post. Oh, thank you. And you know, it just kind of hit me like, you know, this looks because I was working, had been working on that little thing, and I was like, it looks like a brain. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> so you know, wouldn't it not be cool to like put that picture I have of my um when you had your in? aneurysm, yeah, your stroke. Yeah, because it's so the analogy of how because it is it's so true because just because when things happen and that's the whole lecture they give you 
is the neuroplasticity in the brain, how it can regrow. Yeah. And things happen. Rewire and, itself. Yeah. And I'm like, it happens. It does. And it may not come back exactly the same. Um, and it's, and you're not going to be the same. You're going to be different after the whole thing. But I think I'm a better person than I was before. Are you doing? not like better? But I mean, better inside than out. Oh, okay, you know. Yeah. So, but I think I'm smarter too. <laughs> <laughs> well, you found the perfect glasses, so I did. You know why? Let me tell you. Let me tell you, I had to go to the eye doctor. I was getting so bad. I can't see far away now either. That got worse, my far away vision and my near vision. So I had to wear smart visions, 20 smart glasses 24 7 now. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it just is like, so I got two pair. The other pair I fell asleep in and I got to go get them fixed. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Because they got kind of crooked. glasses are expensive. They yes, are. they are. And John got me the nice pair. <laughs> so, because my insurance only paid like so much. And he was, oh, well, let's, he picked things out and was like, yeah, those look like you. Aww. So he did good. I just had to renew my license and I was super happy. I didn't, I could read the uh, vision test at the DMV. <laughs> I don't want to That always after. makes you happy. Yeah. Yeah. I did get mine last year. I don't think I, I don't remember what I had to do or not do, but I got them anyway, my license, but I don't drive that much. Yeah. I don't know if there's going to be golf tonight or not because Buffalo Bills are playing Monday night football tonight. Hippie, what's happening? I'll have to see if, because I'm sure my wife will be watching the, the sports having... balls. <laughs> yes, Tim, an advocate for liberty. Thank you. Well, we've, we've been on a pretty good roll, Wendy. We haven't made I know, it we've been making some good stuff, huh? Yeah. Yeah, I'm happy with what I did yesterday. And then this right here is good. And I did another one um, just on my own a few <laughs> weeks ago. The, what was it? The strawberry, strawberry mango. Oh my God. That's one of my favorites now. My strawberry. Oh, really? Mango. Or what did I call it? Straw, Strawgo. That's what I named it. Strawgo. Wendy making up some more base? No, I'm mixing something for somebody else. Just some Mountain Dew real quick. Oh, you're a good soul. Yeah. I figure while I'm here, while I'm doing this, might as well do it now. There we go. We get drip hacks concentrate. Do we get drip hacks concentrates in the U.S.? Drip hacks. I've never heard uh, of it. No, I don't think so. I think... That should, that's in um, the UK. I know that, but no, I don't think we have it here. Yeah, Cloud Suckers or Cloud Trucker says there's some good flavors. Yeah, there's some and amazing. I think it's at Num Nums where I've seen it, if I'm correct. Yeah, Chevy, I don't know. That's my wife's a big sports fan. So I don't know if there'll be golf tonight or not. Maybe I'll watch some of the Bills game with her. The Bears. That's it. The Bears. Oh, who is doing that? The Bills. The Bears. Adam, he can do that so good. <laughs> I know. Adam is a good announcer, the good PA guy, the good singer. Yeah, he's just good at that stuff. Yeah. Yeah, it is golf night. It's always golf night. <laughs> okay guys well it's 9 30 i'm gonna go and have some breakfast so that i can go to sleep <laughs> nice. wendy's all I backwards wake up and do this all again tomorrow oh and wow yeah but you'll have a, a nice latte to vape tomorrow well i'm gonna i'm gonna try to hold off i'm okay. gonna vape on my cheesecake for the week got it 
And yeah, the spice, I'm gonna the pumpkin spice latte. Side. I want to wait till next week. Hi, mm. happy hippie. Have a good night. All right, everybody. Well, thank you so much for being here. Mm. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, you can check out my recipes. They should be up already. Plus, I put them in chat in case you missed it. They should be up on ELR. And we've got the pumpkin cheesecake from last week. Absolutely amazing. We also tried the, um, whatchamacallit, the apple pear caramel. caramel apple pear. That was good. That's like a nice baked apple. Really, really nice. Um, and then, well, of course, you know, my milkshake base, we also put that in there, um, which is great with anything. So if Heck you're yeah. looking for a milkshake, add anything to it. I saw somebody mention chocolate. Add some chocolate. I actually want to try it with creme de menthe. I think oh, that would be nice. absolutely Yum. amazing with that milkshake. Yeah. Um, that'll be like a chocolate mint milkshake. I think that would be absolutely perfect. Um, we even made a peanut butter milkshake. We've actually added so much to the milkshake. The eggnog is amazing. The pumpkin um, <laughs> milkshake turned out great. So yeah, check them all out. And um, yeah, that's it. And maybe Tim will be here next week. Who knows? <laughs> yeah, maybe. I hope. Yeah. We'll just keep our fingers crossed. That's and right. Be here. <laughs> and we'll be back. Oh, and see what and I'm, about. I'm glad. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you all for being here. We love you. Yeah, Each love and you guys. Have a great week. See you and later.